can wear on all of us, of <laughs> yeah. course. Instead of hours, imagine cutting the trip from Chicago to Minneapolis to just minutes. Who likes a long drive? Nobody. Nobody. Now that is still a far away scenario, but a group of UW-Madison students is helping to lay the groundwork. Christina Laurie's live on campus with how you can get a sneak peek of this newest design. Good morning, Christina. Good morning. So this team is super impressive. They're a group of students, undergrad students, known as the Badger Loop team. And they certainly spend a lot of time here on campus, not only in class, though. Over the past few months, they've been building and now perfecting their latest innovation, which could help serve you in the near future. It's a pod that is designed to reach top speed in a hyperloop. Think of that like a train rail surrounded by a vacuum tube, so there's no air resistance. That means it can travel at speeds of up to 100 miles an hour. The the idea is to cut down on transportation times between cities that may be too close to book a flight between, but are still a long drive, say from Chicago to the Twin Cities. The whole idea of the Hyperloop pod and the Hyperloop technology is to push the boundaries of how fast you can go on ground transportation and to kind of supplement planes, trains, and automobiles as another method of high-speed transportation from city to city. While the team says that reality is likely far away, it could become the future of transportation. You'll be able to check out that pod for yourself in person tonight here at the Memorial Union. It starts at 7 o'clock. Badger students will be on hand to answer any questions that you might have about their futuristic innovation. And then they'll enter that pod in a worldwide competition, the fourth annual SpaceX competition. We'll talk more about that and their plans ahead for the summer months coming up at 6. I just think this is so cool that there are students in our own backyard right doing this here. really incredible work and everybody can get behind shorter drive times, Christina. It kind of puts to shame what we all were doing in college. Right. I never did anything this oh, worthwhile. Yeah. Oh, oh, I'm amazed. Not an impressive student. These, these kids <laughs> beat me for sure. All right, Christina Laurie, we'll check in with you in a little bit. Thank you.